Work began quickly as Texas became the first state to start using federal grants to plug orphaned oil and gas wells. The first wells were in Refugio County, where it was back-to-back -back work for plugging contractors. Right here is like four wells, five wells on this piece of property. And then, uh, so we moved from one to the next to the next. A major reason the Railroad Commission was able to start the plugging so quickly is the agency's extensive experience and work plans running the nationally recognized State Managed Plugging Program, or SMP. Boots on the ground, it's the exact same thing. Um, it's just keeping organized and separated what is federally funded and what is state managed plugging. The SMP has exceeded performance measures set by the legislature for six years and counting. The initial federal grant, which is $25 million, will be used to plug about 800 orphaned oil and gas wells in addition to what will be plugged in the SMP. All the RRC work in the different projects is to ensure Texas residents and the environment are kept safe. The, the main importance of this is we are protecting the groundwater of the state of Texas. It's a possible conduit for pollution into our fresh water. And as you know, um, there's no economic growth if you don't have fresh water. And so we have to protect that, and we should protect that. That's part of our mission statement at the Railroad Commission. According to a 2021 report by the Interstate Oil and Gas Compact Commission, Texas saw one of the lowest increases in the orphan well population among all producing states since 2018, despite being the number one oil and gas producer in the country. The commission has a webpage on federally funded well pluggings, which includes an updated list of wells that are being plugged across the state. Contractors are busy and ensuring all reporting is being done correctly for federal guidelines. We have to do the e-comply to report the, uh, the wages that we're paying to all of our workers to make sure that they're in compliance with the area of the, the minimum wage, the Davis-Bacon Act. Mm -hmm. It's just added work yeah. and we're ready for the challenge.